Fournette. Fournette goes airborne. He's in. Touchdown, Jaguars. Tip and intercepted by Ramsey to close it out. It's over. The Jacksonville Jaguars have pulled off the upset of the playoffs. What is going on, everybody? It is Treeb from Treeb Talks here, here to preview the week number 12 matchup between the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Buffalo Bills. Now, at the beginning of the season, this game looked like a trash game for completely different reasons. Everybody thought the Jaguars, by this time, are going to be submitting themselves as an elite squad, and the Bills, they were going to be on a downhill slope. However, one of those things is still true. The Bills are still on a downhill slope, but the Jags are as well. This is the game that plays on Sunday that no one wants to watch. We're back in that spotlight, baby. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am Tree from BigJReport.com. This is the Jacksonville Jaguars versus Buffalo Bills, week number 12 preview. Now, my big thing this week is I'm not going to Gus Bradley this, but in, in my case, I think this week there's some sort of moral victory here. There's been, you know, Jags fans and Titans fans clash all the time, but the Titans have our number, and that's just flat-out truth facts. Like, until further notice, the Titans have all the bragging rights in the world, but damn it, Bill's Twitter is one of the worst Twitters out there, and they are always attacking the Jags like, we sold out your stadium. Yeah, but did you win? No, you lost. And hopefully this week, we go down there, and we destroy the Buffalo Bills, and we do what we need to do. Like, this is... A game the Jags should most definitely, definitely win. And like I said in my rant video, I'm not 100% sure if we are capable of doing that, of going out there and winning. However, Jalen Ramsey is playing Josh Allen. I do believe Josh Allen is playing uh, this week. If not, then the GOAT Matt Barkley uh, will be playing. Matt Barkley, when I was a young kid, you know, just getting into the NFL, really getting into the draft process, I really liked Matt Barkley. If you can't tell by now, I have an eye for QB talent. Matt Barkley, Jimmy Clausen, Blake Bortles, you know, like Jameis Winston. You know, all those guys are guys that were I was super high on. So, you know, if you need anybody to be a draft expert, it's definitely Treeb from Treeb Talks, especially at the quarterback uh, position. But nonetheless, the Bills do do things well. Their defense is mildly underrated, um, <clears throat> and Blake Bortles is just going to have to not throw the ball at all. I'm fine if we win this game just giving Leonard Fournette, Carlos Hyde, and TJ Yeldon all the runs and all the catches. I don't really care. This season is over, but there are just like some specific games that you just want the Jags to go out there and fucking win, and this is one of those games. There's really nothing I can preach too much on how I think we should win this game um, or how we need to play not to lose because it's so straightforward, yet we have lost six straight games. We cannot make it seven. That would be just downright embarrassing uh, for this team that was on such an up and up, and now they're on the decline, uh, mostly due to the offensive coordinator, defensive coordinator. Um, in the quarterback position, there's a lot to be blamed, that's for sure. But... You know, if the Jags go out there and they do things right and they do everything right, this is a game in no way, shape, or form the Jags should lose. I am talking shit because I hate Bills fans. So if Bills fans you want to be my mention, dislike the video, all that, I don't care. I don't like the Bills. I don't like Bills fans, you know. I think that without a doubt, the Bills are the worst team in the NFL, at least one of them, behind maybe the Raiders and the Cardinals. They, they have a worse quarterback situation than us. This is like, the Bills have all these quarterbacks that I would take Blake Bortles over, and these days that's hard to find. And we have this defense that has underachieved all year long. Jalen Ramsey, if you want to see that, you want to prove Josh Allen's fucking trash, let's get three picks this week. Let's go out there and do that. I want this to just be a monumental uh, confidence booster. I just want us to go out there and beat them like... I want to beat them bad. Like, I want to go out there and score 40, 50 points, something outrageous like that. This is a game the Jags should no doubt be winning, and that's why I don't have any notes. That's why I'm not really sitting down here and telling you specifics because I think we outmatch the Bills everywhere on the board. And the only time that that's really happened this season uh, where we beat everybody basically across the board was the Jets, and we went out there, we dominated the Jets. We need to go out there and dominate the Bills, do things old school style, uh, salvage some some of the season 
Like I said, the playoff hopes are definitely more than likely dead, but they need to go out there and continue to win and continue to improve. Um, since a lot of these, some of these guys are playing for contracts, and you know, some of these guys are just playing to stay and be here. You know, guys like Malik Jackson, somebody at the defensive line position will be getting cut this next off season. If they don't want it to be them, they want to earn their money, then they got to step up and they got to play well in games like this, games that you are expecting them to go out and win. And with that being said, I hope the Jags win 42-10, to but on the way we have been playing this season, it is so, so hard to tell what is going to happen. And that was my Jaguars versus Bills week number 12 preview. What did you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Don't forget to check the links down below as well. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at Troop Talks. Follow me on Twitter at Trevon Pixley and follow me on Instagram at Trayvon Pixley. Also, if you're feeling oh so generous, you can go ahead and donate on Patreon. That's patreon.com forward slash Troop Talks. Also, if you haven't yet, click that subscribe button. Click the bell icon so you get notified every single time I drop a new video. I drop new Jaguar content on this channel six days a week. Ain't nobody outworked me. Then just straight back. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And as always, you guys have a great day.